In our society today, we are more connected than ever. But how much of that connectedness is with deep, authentic relationships? So many people today crave that type of relationship and simply don't have it. Yet those are the relationships formed through the ministries and fellowship at First Christian Church. I have a son that's uh, 11 that has autism and I have a daughter that's nine. And they welcome my children, they love my children. My children love this church. Everybody welcomed you. Everybody loved you. Uh, they were concerned about you. The people you form relationships with here are those who will walk through life together with you. They are the ones who will show up and celebrate with you, or they'll journey with you as you grieve or make transitions in life. Earlier this year, we started a prayer shawl ministry. We pray as we make the shawls. We pray as we get together and dedicate the shawls to the ministry. We pray with the people we give the shawls to. There's a sense of letting someone know, we see you, we hear you. I truly believe this is a ministry that was meant for us and for this church. Whether it's through Bible study or faith study or fellowship, the relationships formed here are centered in Christ. They're the ones that will walk with you through life and grow for a lifetime. I've had a really stressful week. I'm applying for colleges, I have lots of choir rehearsals or getting ready for Christmas, um, and I have a lot of homework. And so I was looking at Wednesday night youth and I was wasn't sure if I'd have time to go, in all honesty. I had so much to do, but I decided to go. Um, and it was really nice to just be ridiculous and be myself and know that no matter how crazy I was, I could they weren't going to judge me and they would accept me. Well, my specific role in Logos is the kitchen. Logos meal is family style. It's served on the table and the kids pass the dishes around and they all sit at the same table every week. That's so they can all get to know each other and then the table parents involve them in conversation about school and home and a family style situation that we feel like children probably don't get much of. They always have a thank you for the cooks. So that's always a joy. Uh, when they call us in, they have prepared either a, a song or a a cheer or something for the cooks and sometimes we have one to respond back to so that's really what Logos is it's it's fellowship Christ-centered fellowship I like Logos it's fun because we get to do fun activities people here are nice -er than most people when we come together we're not all alike we come from different backgrounds and viewpoints we come together as the one body of Christ, or at least attempting to be the one body of Christ. Christ's ears listening deeply, Christ's voice speaking words of hope for people. That's not just what we do on Sunday morning, it's really more how we live as a community. It's worshiping God with our whole life.